Well, I, I, you know, I, I honestly believe that for a health practitioner to utilize ayahuasca as a treatment modality, th this individual must have uh, significant firsthand experience. They must know the terrain they're sending people into. And uh, they must have the highest ethical standards. Uh, they must be impeccable in regards to their, um, how they approach this whole process. And be, uh, you know, there's, there's a lot to be learned from the 60s also on the downside, that there were reckless and irresponsible individuals who set themselves up as, uh, as gurus, as, uh, you know, as enlightened leaders who were anything but and who caused significant uh, injury and harm to those who entrusted them with their care. We can see other examples even today of um, individuals both uh, within and without the health professions who really are, do not have the requisite uh, mental health and uh, ethical integrity to engage in, in this kind of work. So there'll have to be very careful oversight, a careful prob pro process, uh, you know, vetting individuals and establishing and uh, that they have uh, proper uh, credentials, both in regards to their knowledge base and their, um, and honestly, their, the state of their own psychological health.